Hello guys, welcome to today's video by Trustalia. This is a TS Tech Talk video. So on today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to create playlists on your YouTube application, making use of the YouTube mobile app. So this particular tutorial is going to be useful for both um, the YouTube content creators and the YouTube um, users. So users means um, probably a person that is viewing the video or like the way you are viewing the video right now. So go ahead and open the YouTube application. And there are actually two ways to create a YouTube um, a YouTube playlist. Now to create a YouTube playlist, uh, the first thing or the first method is to come over to the playlist section and then wait for the playlist to load up. Uh, you notice where it says um, new playlist, right? Go ahead and click on new playlist. And then um, click on next, ignore all of this. Um, these are my previous or recently watched video. So click on next and then go ahead and give your YouTube playlist a title. Now the title is going to be name of your playlist. So I'm going to call this um, trust video. Now guys, if you are actually a content creator, you wouldn't be naming this trust video. So if you are a content creator, I think the best um, word to actually name this video is um, just to call it uh, probably the title of that playlist. For instance, um, when I'm making video, I make YouTube tutorials and I make YouTube, YouTube tutorials for mobile device and I also make YouTube tutorial for um, PC users. So uh, most times I'll title this YouTube uh, mobile most times I title this PC um, YouTube PC so depending on what um, playlist I want to create I add the name relating to that particular playlist and then before you hit this create button you notice this particular option right there is also very important if you leave this on private you are going to be the only one seeing this particular playlist so if you are a content creator and you want people to watch that video you added to that playlist you need to click on this private and then select public so um, you can notice the public actually um, describes itself. It says anyone can search and view um, this particular playlist. What it actually means is that people can actually discover this on the search and also they can watch it if they discover it from your um, channel. So maybe if somebody went to your channel and saw this playlist, they can easily watch it at will. So that is actually what this one means. And this unlisted is also very simple. Anyone that you share this link with, they will be able to watch your video. But if you didn't share this link with anybody, they won't be able to know that that particular playlist actually existed. Even though they went to your YouTube channel, they will not be able to see this playlist. Except you shared the link of that playlist with them, they will be able to make use of it. So whichever one it is, go ahead and select that and then hit create so when you hit create it creates the playlist you notice the playlist displays right there so after the playlist display the next thing you might need to do is to add a video on the playlist now if you are a youtube viewer um this is actually how you need to add your videos to the playlist so just go over to any youtube video you are interested in click on the three dotted icon and then do save to playlist and it's going to pop up and display options for you so go ahead and select the exact playlist that you want you can see all of the playlists like there so um do not forget this particular icon means this particular playlist is not visible to anybody so if you want to be the only one to see it choose the playlist that um, only you can see and also you can still create playlist by clicking on this new playlist right there but if you are okay with this just click on done so um let me go ahead and choose another video and click on save to playlist and then you notice it displays those options again i'm going to choose um, this one and then i'm going to deselect this and then i'm going to hit done so if you actually select multiple playlists that video is going to be saved to multiple playlists now the next thing i need to do is to go over to the library section and then i'm going to have to check that particular video to confirm if the videos were saved on the playlist and the videos were all saved to the playlist so if for some reason you want to edit the name of your playlist all you need to do is to click on this pencil icon right there and then click on edit and you edit the name of the playlist and also um, you can add description to your playlist if you choose to or if you want to and then if for some reason you um you added a video to playlist by a mistake and you just want to remove it all you need to do is to click on this three dotted icon right there and then you select remove so that video will be removed from your playlist and your playlist will be updated so if you are okay with that just back out and it saves automatically so that is how 
you add videos to playlist as a user now let's go over to this particular section for a youtube creator so how about it you are a youtube creator you have created so many video you want to add the video to your playlist so i already showed you guys how to create playlist you can also do it as a user now let's assume you have all of this video and you want to add some of this video to your playlist it's as simple as scroll over to the main video click on this three dotted icon and then select add to playlist and it's going to display the same option like before choose the particular playlist and then you hit done but now guys um you notice this is actually a short video now we cannot add short video to our playlist from this particular section we need to actually make use of a different application to do this and the application is actually called yt studio so um, let me show you guys what i mean if you click on this particular video just like you added the other video um if you click on this I can pause the video okay yes i can pause so click on this three dotted icon right there normally you should be able to add the video right here but for some reason you cannot add videos that are from short to your playlist from this section so all you need to do is to back out and click on the home page make sure you have this application downloaded it's called yt studio so um go ahead and search for studio or youtube studio this is the application right there search for it install it and then have it um let's go ahead and hit for it I go, let's go ahead and open the application. I cannot access the application right now because it's showing the updates version right there. So I don't want to update right now. So click on this application. This is the application YT Studio. So once you have it downloaded, that is what is going to be showing. And if you have it open, this is how it's going to load up. Let's wait for it to load up completely. So now the video has loaded up. So click on the content section to access your content. Uh, these are the normal video to add any video right here on your playlist click on this three dotted icon and then do um, edit video and then it shows option for the video click on playlist and select the playlist and then click done so i already have one playlist selected so i'm no longer going to do that you can do the same thing for this other video and click on add to playlist and then select the playlist and click done and then once you're done back out oh hold on it didn't save so i have to click on save make sure you click on save after adding the video to your playlist so it's going to load up and save now let's go over to the short section when you click on short you can see all of the video on your short so go ahead and click on that particular video to edit the video now scroll over to um click on this pencil icon to edit the video i didn't select edit the other time so click on add to playlist and select the playlist you want to add it to and then click on done and go ahead and save the video so it will be saved to your playlist and once you finish saving you just back out and the video has been saved the same thing you can click on this three dotted icon edit video and add to playlist that is how you add video to your playlist and also while on this creator area if you click on the playlist you'll be able to see all of the video existing on your playlist and all of the playlists you have created previously let me go ahead and refresh for some reason um it didn't update uh, automatically so these are your playlists and now guys um you cannot create playlists making use of this particular application although you can do this on the um pc version but you cannot do this on the mobile version for some reason youtube might still have to add that later on so if you go over to the youtube application you will notice that the playlist is still the same thing just like it is so even though you added the video from your creator studio it's still going to appear here without issue so guys this is all i want to show you on today's video and i hope it's helpful if it is thanks for watching and guys i will see you on my next video please stay safe and peace